Nicola Sturgeon was shamed by Scottish Conservative Party leader Douglas Ross at FMQs as she blamed ferry construction delays on inflation and the Conservative Party in Westminster. Scottish Conservative Party leader Douglas Ross slammed Scottish First Minister and SNP leader Nicola Sturgeon at Thursday's FMQs after she attacked the UK government and blamed the further delay in ferries' construction on the soaring inflation and Conservative Party's inability to. T Mr. Ross mocked SNP colleagues for applauding Ms. Sturgeon as she blamed the London government for Scotland's woes before delivering a brutal rebuke, Mr Ross said, of course, the First Minister did her usual thing, she blames Westminster for anything but actually not address the question. She doesn't want to hear what ministers are saying. First Minister's answer was all about outlining what the UK government had. She never mentioned about the ships which we never put into service. Hundreds of millions of pounds couldn't have been wasted. The comments from Mr Ross came as Ms Sturgeon said, I've made clear in many occasions my regret over that. That's why it's so important that we focus on completing the ferries. She continued, our budget has been eroded by inflation soaring with no control under this UK government. It would still leave us hundreds of million of pounds that we have had to allocate unbudgeted but, referring to her party and the current energy crisis, she concluded, we continue to make the hard decision to direct support where it's needed most. One of the pressure over our construction project right now is inflation which the UK government is failing to get under control. We will continue to focus on making sure the ferries are completed on the revised budget and the revised timeline. The comments came as Scottish ministers have recently been warned that the delivery of Glen Sanix ferry, now stuck in Fergus. Thank you.